Hello and welcome to NetApp KB TV. This video is based on KB ID 1013077. This video demonstrates how to configure auto support features on a C dot storage system. Data on tap is capable of sending automated notifications or auto support to the NetApp support center. The notifications contains useful information to help solve or recognize problems quickly and proactively. Although auto support messages to technical support are enabled by default, you must set the correct options and have a valid mail host to have messages sent to your internal support organization. To begin the procedure, log into the C dot storage system. Before configuring the auto support, to see the current auto support settings, type the command as displayed on the screen. This shows the existing auto support settings. The auto support mechanism uses the transport protocols SMTP, HTTP and HTTPS to transmit the auto support messages. In this case, HTTPS is used as a transport protocol. To change the settings, type the command as displayed on the screen. and specify the protocol you want to use. For now, we will retain the HTTPS as transport protocol. Now we shall see how to change the from address, add two addresses and add a mail host to transmit auto support messages. First, we will see how to change the from address. The from address is typically the storage admin mail ID this address is used by NetApp support to contact the storage admin of the company from which the auto supports are received. To add the from address, type the command as displayed on the screen. And the mail address is storage admin at netapp.com. When you add new from address, it overrides the existing from address. Next, add the destination email addresses to receive auto support. Enter the command. Please note, we can add up to 5 email addresses. Enter the addresses as a comma separated list with no spaces in between. All these email addresses will receive a copy of the auto support notifications. There is no need to add auto support at netapp.com as it is included by default. Now add a list of recipients who will receive auto support short note email notification regardless of severity level and the command is. Now let us see how to add a mail server to transmit the auto support messages. Now the required settings have been configured. Let us trigger a test auto support and the command is displayed on the screen. The auto support was successfully invoked on node. To view the status of the auto support, execute the command. We hope you find this video helpful. Please subscribe to NetApp KBTV for more knowledge based videos. Thank you for watching.